One, two, three, four. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, and welcome back to another review from Roy's Reviews. And today we have a pod review for you. Yes, not just any pod, but we have the new Valadin Vantage. Yes, we all know that the Vantage is probably better known as a car, maybe one of my favourite all time car manufacturers, Aston Martin. If I ever win the lottery, that's the first thing I'm going to do is go out and buy an Aston Martin. Vantage, possibly. Yeah, Vantage V8, I would definitely wait and buy. So, this is the pod itself. Um, what I'm going to do is we're going to drop down to the table, have a quick look around the box, because I think it is slightly unique um, in the way that it comes. Then pop back up here again and um, tell you my thoughts, pros and cons. I'll see you in a moment. And welcome down to the table. And here we have the Valadin package itself. As you can see it comes in this beautiful little hard plastic presentation case. And it's got Valadin bandage across the front. Nothing across that side, nothing across that side, nothing across that side, nothing across that side. But then on the back we have got the warning details, the scratch and sniff, authenticity, the batch number, Valadin Global Corporation, all your little warning symbols and then you have your product colour which is black and then you just slip this little cardboard off and you're left with your plastic hard case and then you open it up you've got your Vladen user manual which comes in all the languages you would ever need but at the front it is in English so it tells you all about it and then in the box you have got, if I can get it out, the Valadin itself, the Valadin pod, that's the pod on top. Now this has got a white band on it, if you can see that, that's the juice on it, I've been using it quite a lot. Um, I've had just two over two weeks now using it every day, so I'll just leave the Valadin there. You also get your USB-C connection which is fantastic because with all the phones going to USB-C now you've got the same charger you can actually charge your phone with or you can just use your phone charger as well and then you have got this other spare pod now this is blue oh here it is and this one's clear As you can see. The difference between the two of them, one is mouth to lung and the other one is a direct lung. When you put your pod on, the light flashes white to signify that you have got the white pod in place, which is your direct lung. Just take this bit off little battery or the little pod safety sticker now it's stuck to my finger get off me and whenever you put the direct long pod in it flashes it lights up blue so the pod system itself knows exactly which one you have in and when because when you go back to the white one it flashes up white to quickly go around it so it is 116 millimeters, so 11.6 centimeters tall. It is eight millimeters, eight millimeters that way. So from side to side, eight millimeters. And no, sorry, be eight millimeters that way. Not from where I read it, less than a centimeter. So eight millimeters that way, and then you've got the 12.6 millimeters width that way. The battery is a 700 ma, and when you when you mouth to long it, it's 11 watts. Um, whenever you direct long mode it, it's 15 watts, and it's got a 2 amp charging, and the pod capacity is 1.6 mil, which sits well within the TPD capacities. On the front, you have your firing button, 
one, two, three, four, five. Turns it one, two, three, four, five. Turns it off, so it flashes through the different colours. It will flash um, just to let you know it's turning it off. And then when you go one, two, three, four, five, turn it on. It goes back through the colours to let you know it's active. Your battery indicator is there with the wee LEDs. So there's four of them. When you've got between 80 and 80 and 100% power, you'll have four lights. When it's between 55 and 80, three lights. Between 30 and 55, two white lights. And then between 10 and 30% power, you have one white light on there. When the battery does go below 10% battery power, you have one light flashes three times to indicate that the battery is in low. On the very base, you have your USB-C charging port. On the back of it, you've just got your um, designed by Valadin, made in China, and your warning marks on there. I think this is absolutely beautifully made. Just like the original Valadin, that's the two of them side by side. So it is just slightly taller. It is just ever so slightly wider. But the original Valadin had these little edges on them, which really made for tactile. Because you to play with it in my hand. But with this, it feels solid quality. Um, in your hand, you know, it's, it is plastic. And, but it is really good quality. So what you expect from something named after a, a very high expensive car, it is really, really, really good. Now, a little unique thing about the box. So you put your Valadin in. So you've got your Valadin in there. You've got your spare pod in there for whenever you're um, wanting to do a bit of dry plunging. You've got your 10ml bottle, your Nick salts or whatever it may be. It fits into the box perfectly as well. And it all closes over. And you can just stick that in your pocket and off you go. How cool is that? Yes, I'm easy amused. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to put some juice into the, to, to show you how you fill it, into the direct lung. So to fill the pod, you just hold the base of it like that, take the side and pull the top off. The same way as Vladin has done with their old pod system with this. It's just the top comes off but before you had a rubber stopper on there. But with this, the stoppers are already down. You probably can't see down in there. But the stoppers are already down in the base of that to stop anything coming out the holes. So you've no wee rubber grommets. That's a big thumbs up from me on that. So a little bit of gator juice, gator vapes and kiwi berry put into this. And it's just a matter of putting your nib into the pod and squeeze and I found it easier if you do it halfway on one and then go to the other one so the air then escapes out the other side to give yourself a nice even fill as easy as that and then you just put the lid back on top always recommend just to leave it for a while to let the juice soak into the cotton and into the coil and therefore making your life a lot easier. So folks that is the Valadin Vantage. Join me back up when I take it for a vape and I'll tell you my pros and cons. And welcome back up again folks. As you can see I'm back out into Michelle's vape lounge nail bar. If that's what you want to call it. It's just a lot, lot quieter at the moment out here with the kids being at home there in the house over there. So, what do I think? Vape wise, absolutely fantastic. Lovely, lovely um, direct mouth to lung um, resistance on there to give you just enough vapour. You can press the button or you can just pull to, to draw a vape. What I have found 
if you pull just use the the sucking action it takes a little bit longer for the vape to warm up and is not just as strong as powerful a vape and that where you press the button you get the instant warmth and you get more of a vape from it plus I don't know if you're picking this up on the mic total instantaneous press the button and it fires there's no waiting um, no nothing the drip tip shape of it is absolutely perfect for the mouse it sits in lovely they have got it sort of glossed over don't know if you can see just the shape of the mouth there is glossed over and then they've got the the same finish on the side of the pod as they have down this the air holes are there on this side there's an air hole and there's an air hole on that side so you can if you didn't like how area it is you can actually close off one of the air holes by holding it and it gives you a slightly more restrictive flow now if you hold both of them closed you still can get a vape really really strong restrictive vape on there that's the pros and well another pro is just the, the, the feel of it when you've got it in your hand even though it is plastic it does feel quality one con that I have found with this is that I would like the pods rebuildable you'll be able to put your own um, coil and cotton in there whenever you do whenever the, the coil does burn out you do have to then um, replace the whole top pod system which is the only thing, only my only downfall but Vladen always has been like that and it'll probably continue to be like that but it's not a major, not a major con I say I've had this now for two weeks I have constantly, constantly been vaping on it every, well not constantly I have been using it every single day still got the first pod system in here only now after two weeks is the flavour starting to deteriorate a little that's not bad going, 14 days of constant use of Nick Salts going through this. And it's been Riot Squad Nick Salts that's been in there, um, which are quite sweet and quite hard on coins. So, all in all, if you're just going to be using this as a carry around to use every now and again, if you're, um, you'll probably get a lot more than two weeks out of your, your coin. As you've seen down below, I just put in some of the um, Gator Juice, Gator Vape, Kiwi Berry into the direct lung. So it's been sitting now for a good few minutes, um, probably 5 or 10 minutes. What I'll do is pop it in, it lights blue to let me know it's now gone direct lung. So let's have a wee go on this and see what it's like. Look at that vapor for days and the flavor is absolutely immense now I've reviewed this just yonks and yonks ago and I've had to pick it up every now and again for a vape so I do know what the juice is, the flavor is meant to be like and that is spot on for flavor now when you're on direct lung you can't just suck the pull it doesn't work you have to press the button because it's going into the higher wattage so you have to use the button but oh my god what a flavor now i've had many a pod system quite a few pods as michelle says too many pods where would i rate this this has got to be up there with one of my top three or four pods systems um my other daily banger which is the Aegis pod system I do love but this is definitely up there with them I would definitely give this a 9.5 out of 10 um, would I recommend to somebody to buy it? would I buy it if I hadn't bought it myself? yes um, I do like my Vladen products I've got the Vladen slide, I've got the Vladen, the original Vladen the Vladen with the refillable pod systems um, I do like my Vladens maybe the other wee thing that you can maybe look at for this is a lanyard 
um, because the lanyard on my old the little Valadin was very handy for when I was out and about doing photography things like that, to have it hanging around my neck instead of being in my pocket, mean down to take photos etc. So a little lanyard for this maybe may do. Um, the original lanyard for the Valadin doesn't fit it, I have tried. So it's just slightly because it's slightly thicker. So folks, that's it from me. If you've enjoyed this review, give me a wee thumbs up or you can give me a thumbs down, either way it doesn't matter. I just appreciate the interaction. And drop me a wee comment down below if I could do anything better and, or if you've liked it. And up here there will be a, a link back. I don't never, never know what side it's going to be at. One of these two sides, um, there will be a link back to a previous review of mine and the subscribe button is there as well. So if you're not already subscribed to me, drop me a sub wee subscribe. I appreciate every single person that does subscribe and interacts with my videos. And I also just have to note and say as well that this product was sent to me for the purposes of review by Valadin. So thank you very much to Valadin for doing that. It hasn't influenced my opinion on this whatsoever. If the product had been rubbish, I would tell you it had been rubbish because there's nothing worse than watching some reviews and people going, oh this product's absolutely fantastic. You rush out and you buy it, you get it home and you go, oh, that's pants. I definitely, definitely would highly recommend the Valadin Vantage. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you've watched this review. Take care now. Bye. Two, three, four.